As the hours of darkness increase during the fall season, studies have shown that so do the numbers of pedestrian-involved accidents and fatalities. According to the Minnesota Department of Transportation, 28 pedestrians have been killed this year alone in the state of Minnesota. Last year, 42 pedestrians were killed and over 1,000 were injured. The past couple years have been um, really high for pedestrian fatalities, so much so that um, that many fatalities haven't occurred since 1991. In fact, in just the past 10 years, nearly 150 pedestrians and over 220 bicyclists have been killed, making crosswalk safety a top priority. Not everybody's paying attention to what's going on, and it's really important for both the pedestrian and the driver to be looking and even making eye contact with each other to make sure the other person notices you and that you get the nod to go ahead. Staying safe while crossing could be as simple as knowing basic crosswalk laws. This includes obeying all traffic signs and signals, motorists stopping for pedestrians at marked crosswalks, and finally proceeding after pedestrians have crossed. According to crash data, both motorists and pedestrians are equally at fault when it comes to these crosswalk accidents. The best way to avoid this is for both parties to both know and obey all traffic laws. I think it just goes back to the fact that everyone needs to be responsible for themselves, and we're all people, you know, whatever our mode of transportation is. Reporting for UTVS News, I'm Tanya Nyberg.